Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you about Spire James Syndrome Imaging. Technology. It is a quite unilateral pulmonary hypoplasia sought to result from childhood viral infection, post infectious bronchiolitis of veteran, results in small hyper expanded lung with relative decrease in vascularity. Most common signs and symptoms, frequent respiratory infection in infancy or childhood, most common infection are donor adenovirus, OSV, influenza IV, mycoplasma pneumonia, childhood Bronchiolitis apparatus is usually post-infectious, but also may be related to other insults such as aspiration, toxic fumes, organ transplantation, chronic or wheezing, recurrent pneumonia. Other signs and symptoms, variable presentation range from severe to asymptomatic, restrictive pattern on pulmonary function tests. Demography, usually present in infancy or childhood, less severe case may be missed until adulthood, often found in inventory in the other part. Radiograph, asymmetric hyperlucency line with diminished number and caliber of vessel may simulate hemodrive. ALCT are dripping in affected line, small central and peripheral pulmonary artery, occasional bronchiectasis with minimal subfloral scarring, bronchial wall sickening usually mild. From the radiograph, so a 13 months old with typical symptom a radiographic finding of viral airway disease, a risk factor for later de developing spire chain syndrome. Now, the asymmetric ge geographic area of airspace, opacity, and volume loss that mostly involve the dry line. Call up CT in the same patient, HLRA, so a focal hyperlucency in affected area of the right lung, note the presence of attenuated vessel causing through the involved area. Frontal chair radiograph in the previous LCA years old after a viral illness while traveling abroad demonstrate with symptomatic lucency and mild hyper expansion in left upper low. Coronal check reconstruction in same patient. So the presence of narrow caliber vessel in the affected area, bronchi were normal, and there is no mass effect. Congenital lobar over expansion, which also present early in life. AP radiograph in four or four years old boy with a story of fungi anemia, bone marrow transplant, and multiple pulmonary infections include OSV, so bilateral lobe 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 hyperlucency and attenuation of vessel. Right more than left. Note that the right lung is smaller than the left. Axial expiratory chair CT in the same patient illustrate area of bronchiolitis of veteran in the lobe lobe compared to the normal upper lobe Treatment. Pneumo 
Ectomy is reserved for intractable recurrent infection. Treatment is supportive care. Thank you.